Hairs. If I'm just micro, I'm talking about millimeters off of it. And I try to hammer it in with the angle, it pushes my cap out a little bit. It pushes the, if it's off my hair longer than the cap, the runner, it pushes the post out and it creates a little tiny gap on my perfect cap. So I was like, I have to get it a little short or right on the money. That's why I had to cut back and forth like six times to see the, the nightmare. You see the nightmare from these corners? The nightmare from these corners are ridiculous. So, look at the angle. Oh, they're going to go for the gate. I'm going to fix this. Fix this nightmare. See, like that kept coming short, but I can't cut, I have to cut it at an angle to slide it in. But this has to fit first. This has to fit first. Because.
monstrous gate. It's nice. Look at that beauty. Subscribe to perfection. Came back and redid that. Let me show you the top. It is a beauty. I already showed you how I notched the corners here and got around those two posts in the back. They wanted it as close to the concrete as they could, so we shifted everything forward. Beautiful gate, dang. Beautiful hardware. Look at these long. I thought they were gonna get an aluminum gate, but I guess not. They might change their mind later, but look, see, I even cut that so there's not like a empty spot. Went to the corner, we had to run it. We had to run it flush. Normally we tow into that, but it, since we shipped everything forward, we came in front to cover that little awkward corner where they just the neighbors put just one by fours. It was terrible. I'll show y'all pictures of that later. But finally finished. Started here. Started in this corner. He described it with the brick, even though there's some vine growing here. He described it so it runs flush all the way down. Just to cover this gap between the brick column and the fence. Kind of so put a gap in here, we covered it. They just had like a random one by fours there. It was terrible. I think you see pictures. Look at it. Tucked in tight. Scribe. I'm gonna say it's that out, but look, no gap. You're gonna say that's old post. No gap, scribe. Even that, even that was scribe. I can see it, but you want it tucked tight. Don't get these posts in the room to move anymore. Scribe. Scribe it through perfection. So I'm just gonna voice over this part. This is the finished product of what we got to build from the ground up. The front facing sides. Um, the sides in the rear, the back side of the fence had to be disassembled, salvaged, and rebuilt properly. With the old posts, we got to rebuild this from the ground up. Um, the full before and after is coming soon, so I hope you enjoy. Thank you.